Getting a kick out of English. Unraveling idioms. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of English language learning. Today, we're exploring a fun and commonly used phrase, get a kick out of it. Whether you're a beginner or advancing in English, understanding idiomatic expressions can be both challenging and exciting. So, let's unravel the mystery behind this expression and discover how to use it in everyday conversations. At first glance, this phrase might conjure images of physical action, but it's actually a figurative expression. To get a kick out of something means to enjoy something greatly or find it amusing. The kick here is metaphorical, suggesting a burst of excitement or pleasure, not a physical action. This idiom can apply to any experience that brings joy or laughter, from watching a comedy to trying out a new hobby. The phrase, get a kick out of it, is believed to have originated in the early 20th century, with kick being slang for a jolt of pleasure or excitement possibly linked to the kick from a strong alcoholic drink or the thrill of doing something daring. Understanding its origins helps us appreciate the playful and evocative nature of English idioms. To help you grasp how to use this expression, let's look at some examples. I really get a kick out of playing video games with my friends. This means the person enjoys playing video games with friends a lot. She gets a kick out of solving difficult math problems. Here, it shows that she finds pleasure in the challenge of solving math problems. We got a kick out of watching old cartoons yesterday. This implies that watching old cartoons was a delightful and amusing experience. Using idioms like, get a kick out of it, can add color and personality to your English. Here are a few tips. Context is key. Use this phrase in informal settings, such as conversations with friends or in personal narratives. Be expressive. When you say someone gets a kick out of something, emphasize the joy or amusement it brings. It's all about conveying emotion. Practice makes perfect. Try incorporating this idiom into your spoken or written English to become more comfortable with its usage. We hope you got a kick out of learning about this idiom. Idioms like, get a kick out of it, enrich your English, making it more vibrant and expressive. Remember, mastering idioms is a journey. Enjoy the process, and don't hesitate to experiment with them in your daily conversations. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe for more English language tips. Happy learning! and see you in our next video.